the first thing that we're gonna make that pretty much everyone loves and is always a winner is our tater tot breakfast casserole. So let's go ahead and get our items and get started. For this recipe, you will need a pound of cooked breakfast sausage. You'll need a dozen eggs. You'll need two cups of shredded cheese and a half cup of milk. Now we can't forget the tater tots. Take your tater tots and put them to the side. They're gonna be our last step. You wanna start off with cooking your breakfast sausage. While your breakfast sausage is cooking, we're gonna go ahead and get started with the eggs. So you wanna whisk 12 eggs. So we have our whisked eggs. All you're gonna do is add the two cups of cheese, shredded cheese. Add salt and pepper to taste. Now add your milk. And last but not least, add your sausage. There's not much grease in this at all, so I'm not gonna drain it, but if you see there's a lot of grease in your sausage, please drain it. Okay, so you're gonna mix everything together. Everything that you pretty much like in an omelet, sausage, cheese, eggs. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so good. So we have everything mixed. Now we're gonna get our nine by 13 grease pan. Now you want to set the tater tots to how you would like them to be displayed when the dish is finished. So make sure you put them nice and neat. Don't just throw them in. You can create rows that are even, or you can just put the tater tots anywhere on the dish. You just wanna make sure that all of the tater tots are laid out nice and neatly, and they're just not on top of each other. Now what I love about this casserole is that it's hearty, it's easy to make, and it's a crowd pleaser. And it's something that you can switch up. If you have people who don't eat pork, you can add turkey sausage. It's really that simple. You always wanna have a recipe in your back pocket that you can easily throw together and it can make everyone happy. This is that recipe. Okay, so we're all done with that. Now you're gonna put this in the oven for 55 to 60 minutes. And after that, you'll be good to go. So let's go ahead and get this in. Seriously, do you see how easy this was? I mean, you can do it too. It really didn't take much effort. It's an easy recipe to make in a short amount of time. So if I can do it, you can do it too. Always remember that. Now, if there's a recipe that you wanna see and I'm just not putting it out there, go ahead and comment below and let me know what you wanna see next. Also, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video with someone you think is awesome. I mean, you wanna share the love, right? <laughs> and make sure you find my social media info right below this video. Until next week, I'll see you at the same time, same place. I'm Rosalind Daniels, and I'll see you soon.